<laughs> so fabric is, is metaphor, but it's a very apt metaphor for what the universe is, because the universe can curve. It can curve back on itself. It can stretch. If you're not happy with fabric, come up with another term, but I think we're good. I think it's pretty good. All right. All right. This question comes from Geezer Windbag. <laughs> Greetings, Dr. Tyson. I'm curious why we say the universe exploded in the Bing, Big Bang. It seems to me more likely that the singularity expanded and fragmented, and the universe we see is still all within the singularity. An observer outside the original singularity would still see a singularity, though from our perspective, the universe is incredibly huge. Thoughts? Okay, so a couple of things. The If he doesn't like the word explosion, I'm okay with that, because the singularity that birthed the universe was the rapid stretching of space-time. There we go. Okay. <laughs> see what I did there? So the rapid stretching, uh, you can say, was there an explosion? You know what an explosion is? It is a rapidly moving shock wave within a medium. That's what blows out windows and door blows down doors. It's a shock wave moving through the air. Well, the Big Bang is not a thing moving through something else. It is the expansion of space and time. So it's more accurate to say it's the big stretch rather than the Big Bang. The Big Bang was used pejoratively by, we're now going back 70 years, by a, an opponent of the Big Bang who couldn't imagine the universe would begin this way. 